our course content today, we're going to define source documents and data integrity. And definitely there are differences in the different groups definitions at times. So we're going to really try to, to um, put that to rest. What is really the definition of source documents and data integrity and in, the, in a real study? And then identify, we'll talk about regulatory authorities required characteristics internationally for source data. And we'll talk about source document worksheets throughout the presentation and at the end we'll go into when is the case report form appropriate to be the original source data. And we'll evaluate some best practices as a group. I did send you some correspondence that's been done with the FDA because it's really freedom of information that having the Freedom of, in of Information Act within the United States, we really get a, a lot of information from the FDA, so we use them a lot. And so we sent you some correspondence that has been done with them about some of these key questions and hopefully that comes in handy. So what I suggest you do now or and then formally after is when you go through this presentation, create a checklist of things that are really key about um, source documents in general and specific to trial use. So there are key things that I imagine you'll, you'll want to follow up on or research or look to see if your practices meet those or you might be developing your practices.